How can we communicate student learning expectations to community partners? Keeping learning at the center of experiential learning activities is key. While this may seem simple when it comes to in-class experiential learning activities such as simulations or even with field experiences that use the external community as a living lab, this becomes more complex with some forms of community engagement, including work-integrated learning. While the learning can be rich during these experiences, it's easy to slide into a work-related environment, aim to do well within the large learning curve that often occurs, but lose sight of the academic learning outcomes that prompted the experience. A variety of tips and tools are included in this module for students and their supervisors. These tools aim to ensure learning is a lasting focus and that supervisors are equipped to also think beyond the workplace and coach students with a focus on learning. Working with new industry partners can, the first time through, can be a bit of a learning curve for everyone involved. So there's always a bit more, I think, effort involved in creating and fostering those new relationships. A lot of it is expectations, managing those expectations. The challenges of, uh, of those expectations, I think, are better managed through embedding some of those evaluation mechanisms right within the course. That project management course is a perfect mode for delivery for us, yeah. Failing is a learning opportunity. You get to see, okay, I tried something, it didn't work. Now I need to try something different. Doesn't mean that the different thing you try will work, but recognizing what you're doing is not good enough and changing it and thinking about why I need to change it is definitely a valuable learning opportunity. A large piece of the project has to do with the client relationships um, surrounding the project and the project management. And so a, a large piece of it is me first setting up that relationship to ensure that the students are getting a client that will respect the fact that they're a student, um, number one, and respect the fact that they're still learning, knowing that they are almost ready to go out the door. So there may be some bumps along the way, but there's nothing that we can't resolve. The internship is a growth experience for our students where they are to be exposed to various facets of human resources management. And yes, absolutely, they can make a contribution while they're there, but these are learners and it is important that they are exposed to as much learning and development and feedback as possible during the practicum experience, during that internship experience. That's a really important thing for the host to understand. And at the same time, it's about prepping the student for their experience as well. I think I know, I, I can sense when an experiential learning opportunity is successful, um, although I think ultimately the, the measure of that success will lie in the individual or in the student or in the youth that we're working, working with. 